Much like with every input channel, the SQ has processing built into every mix channel. Selecting LR, an auxiliary or group or matrix channel, and going to the processing screen, we can see an overview of this. Touching the top section, we can patch a mix external in and adjust preamp settings if available. We can also adjust the channel millisecond delay here, often used on an output to time aligned speaker systems. The next section is the insert. This can be used to insert internal rack effects units or for external analog or digital processing. Then comes the graphic EQ. The SQ has a 28 band stereo graphic EQ built right into every mix channel. This can be adjusted on screen by touching a band and using the touchscreen rotary, but by pressing the fader flip key on the surface, we can show and adjust the GQ on faders. In this mode, frequencies are shown on the channel strip displays, RTA levels are shown on the chromatic channel meters, and the master channel controls the mix level, all to enable quick and easy monitoring and adjustment. To reset a band to zero, just press the relevant select key. Pressing the fader flip key multiple times cycles through all frequencies and then exits this mode. After the graph EQ, we have a four band fully parametric EQ. This is the same EQ as is found on the input channels and can be adjusted by selecting values on screen or by using the dedicated rotary controls. Finally, we have a compressor. Along with detailed parameter control and a histogram to show activity, there is a sidechain and filter, as well as the option to switch in parallel processing for blending wet and dry signal. All of this processing is available on every mix channel at all times, so you can mix without compromise.